is out for the week. He's in Barcelona traveling. I'm hoping that he's making the right choices. It can be so difficult when you first start a diet. Um, it's not really part of his lifestyle yet, so he's got to get into the routine of choosing you know, healthy food over sugar and sweets and things like this. And being in Barcelona, oh, there's way too much temptation between all the ice cream places and pastries. So, Mehdi, please stay strong. <laughs> So I'm in the airport, uh, going from Barcelona to Lisbon. As you can see, there's a lot of food and temptation, but I'm doing okay. Should be alright. We'll be doing good, we'll survive, no temptation, no cheat day. Uh. I did cheat yesterday, it was my cheat day, but um, I think I went uh, a bit crazy because I had, I had a pizza, I didn't eat all of it though, which I used to do, uh, what else did I have, I tried one of the local pastries which, is, uh, which looks very yummy. <laughs> Okay, so many when you're out and about uh, this week, just make sure you're making the right choices. Like if you're in a grocery store, for example, shop around the perimeter, that's where all the fresh food is. Try to avoid the aisles, that's where all the processed food is, including like cereal bars and things like this that you may think are healthy, but actually they contain a lot of sugar. Uh, I've been able to avoid as much sugar as possible during this trip, eating fruit, proteins, and working out. So I'm pretty happy about that. Uh, I'm gonna I'm gonna keep uh, trying and then uh, we'll see but uh, so far uh, so good so uh, yeah I'll see you very soon and then uh, we can discuss the rest and uh, in the meantime uh, you can be sure that I won't visit this type of restaurants that you see back there <coughs> so guys um, that marks the end of my trip here in Europe, so between Barcelona and Lisbon. Uh, it's been great, I've seen a lot of good things. Uh, Food-wise, it was a bit difficult, uh, just because a um, healthy option was not always uh, available. So I kind of went with like uh, grilled meat, grilled fish, grilled everything. And um, yeah, breakfast was usually like some fruit and uh, I avoided like snacks and drank uh, a lot of water like uh, Lauren told me and uh, yeah I think I've done uh, okay looking forward to get back to Dubai get back uh, to my routine and uh, get my uh, KKL extra pack every morning because it makes things really 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 easy and uh, that's what I love about it <laughs> So if you're traveling, you need to take a plane, what do you eat on the plane? Um, try to have a gluten-free meal plan if you can. The reason is because they'll take out the bread and the crackers and things like this that you don't need. Um, if not, just eat the protein, eat the veggies, have some fruit and take something with you. Yeah, so um, I didn't really go to the gym because uh, I didn't have time with my work uh, schedule, but I did uh, divide my days in a way that I would walk uh, six to nine kilometers per day so I think it's a good enough workout compared to what I used to do mm -hmm.